All right, so here's how we can connect up Jitsi. So this is where we're having our discussion. This is where the Teach Meet will be live or whatever. I'm going to show you just the really quick way to do it. Obviously, there's more precise ways where you can schedule it and set a date or whatever. This is the thing that we copy and we send a message to everyone so they know what link to join. There's dial in if they want to do all those sort of things. Um, the things you need to know, I guess, are down the bottom left is share your screen, raise your hand in a chat. So the setup is that if you're streaming to YouTube, the chat is just the people in the group. So it could be something like, uh, I'm about to ask you a question or you're up in five minutes or we've had to shuffle it around or the person speaking isn't ready. But we go to the bottom right hand corner, we go to three dots. We're going to click start live stream and it will ask us for a stream key or we could just sign in with our YouTube account or our Google account so that it connects straight away to our YouTube channel. That's kind of the more complicated way to set it up. But the real basic is that we go to our YouTube channel that we have, we go to go live, and we're just gonna add one extra step, which is just setting it up. I'm just going to dismiss this because it wants us to do the same stream we did last time. Uh, since this is a test, we're gonna make it unlisted just so we can see how it works. And we're gonna create a stream. There's nothing really, obviously you can put a nice title and a nice kind of holding background, like an image that people see as they come in. There's a whole bunch of things you can set up to kind of say, you know, we're not ready yet and all those sort of things that you might need to do. But we just go to stream key and we click copy and then we're just going to paste it into here. And this just connects up the two pieces of software. So it's going to tell us in a second that we're now streaming live. Live streaming is on which is not actually true. It just means that they're connected up. And then we'll go back into YouTube and we wait for a moment and we're looking in the top right hand corner for it to say go live, which is basically when it will actually go live. So there's a, I believe a 10 second delay between the two. So obviously the, this will have a camera in it and it, my face and whoever, and uh, you'll have down the right hand side kind of all the other people participating. And then here it looks like we're ready so we click go live and then that's when it actually begins not just to be connected but to actually go live so as of that um, there we go it tells us we're live and we're ready to go uh, obviously it would work a lot better if you could actually see the video and you could see that it was 10 minutes behind i could wave my hands around and all those sort of things but that's the basic information you need to know and then that's just the stream link that you can share out to people so that they know where they are and you might want to schedule it so it's got a specific start time then you can share out the, sh the link uh, beforehand so you can say you know at eight o'clock click the bell to remind yourself to go in and all those sort of things but that's basically all there is to it really um, I've done it a number of times without any issue and I've sort of explained it to other people on how to do it in I reckon less than five minutes I just did it then we end stream and then that's pretty much it job done we'll go back here and that's done. So that's how we do it.